Want to get better results from your mortgage ads? I'm going to show you how you can create a special ad audience to help you reach more people who might be interested in your ad. A special ad audience is similar to a lookalike audience because it uses online behavior similarities from the people in your source to form a new audience. Now keep in mind, a special ad audience is adjusted to comply with the audience selection restrictions associated with the special ad category. So it won't use targeting information such as age and gender or certain demographics, behaviors, or interests. Now, you'll need to create a list of your best prospects and upload it into Facebook. Let me show you how. To create your special ad audience, what you're gonna wanna do is go over to business.facebook.com and um, you'll see that it's kind of changed in the past couple of days, this new format in here. Um, what you'll wanna do is come over here to the left-hand column, you'll see all tools. And that's where you're gonna find audiences down here under the advertise heading. Click audiences. Now the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is going to create that custom audience. This is where you're actually gonna upload your list. From there, that's where you can create your special ad audience. But for now, let's just go ahead and create a custom audience. And this is where you have the opportunity to use your customer list. So you'll click that and click next. So what you'll do is you'll go ahead and um, take a look at this and then just go ahead and click next. And I would assume that your list does not include a column for customer value. So just go ahead and click no. And here's where you can upload your file. So I'm just gonna drag and drop my CSV file in there. I haven't done anything to it. I haven't formatted it or anything. So there's my home buyers leads list. And what I'm gonna to wanna to do is go ahead and name this. So I'm just gonna leave it home buyer lead list. And then I'm gonna hit next. Now here's where you can map your fields appropriately so that you uh, have it set up properly. So your Facebook, you can see here the map to column identifier. See this, it says Facebook user ID. So we're gonna make sure we have that user ID and we're going to want to have phone number we've got email now what about this action needed this is where i can say okay these different things i don't want to have uploaded like i don't need to know if they opted in i don't need their full name i do need their first name though so let's go ahead and put that in there first name last name and these other things are not going to be pertinent so we're just gonna go ahead and click import and create. Now the upload is in progress and there is the home buyer leads list. Now this is a custom audience. So now from here, now what we can do is go into our ads manager. So let's go ahead and click home. All tools, ads manager. Now from here, this is where I can come in and set up the new ad that's gonna use that audience, that special ad audience. So I'm gonna go ahead and click create and uh, you know whatever your consideration is, if you're gonna run a messenger ad or whatever, just go ahead and click messages. And now we can come through here and declare our housing just like we would for the normal ad creation but here in the ad set, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure, you know, you're gonna go through and set your budget and all that stuff, but we're gonna make sure and use a new audience. So this create new right here, we're gonna use special ad audience. Now this zero to 10%, right? So 1% is gonna be most like your current list and you can, change that all the way down to 10%. So it's gonna be less and less more like your list the further up you go. So no worries though. Um, we're gonna select the source and that's gonna be right here, my home buyer leads list. You can see custom audience and 
the audience for the the audience location is going to be United States. There we go. Now you can see this 1%, it's showing 2,740,000 people. No worries, don't worry about that yet. What we're gonna do right now is just go ahead and hit create audience. Now we've created our special ad audience, right? So there it is, special ad audience, home buyer leads list. Now we can get into um, where we're going to show the actual ad itself. So we can come up here to settings and click edit. And this is where we can get specific people who live in, let's just say, Tennessee. There we go. Tennessee. So now we're only going to be showing this ad to people who match our special ad audience that live in this location in the state of Tennessee. And then I want to exclude. So that's where we click right down here. And that's where we can click this list so we're not showing the list to those people so there you go um, now you can kind of create your ad the way that you normally would um, using your ad budget and your spend or if you were gonna be more specific than just um, the whole state of Tennessee or whatever you can you can drop pins um, and do it that way or you can do the whole state you know whatever you like so there's different things that you can do there um, and that should create an ad that will only be shown to people in your special ad or lookalike audience.